And we're back with our wrap-up uh, in terms of the year. Tohinare, uh, what was your highlight for the year, Toh? I wouldn't call it a highlight, um, uh, but, I, but I say the demise of uh, my three favourite All Blacks. Got to be, mm. to me. Daniel Carter, Big Richard McCall. <laughs> <laughs> Richard McCall. Um, yeah, Lomu, um, uh, Berryman, and my favourite of all time, Jerry Collins. Um, yeah, well, he's, he's magnificent, my, my wasn't he? But, 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 but um, in the, on the international stage, um, I think the, the person that stands out to me is Vladimir Putin. Oh, um, and oh. And, I, and, I, and I say that not because I'm a warmonger or anything like that, but over the over a period of a couple of months, he's changed the face of how things are going in Syria. Mm. And right, you know, whether you agree with it or not, um, I, I think he's had a, a pretty uh, uh, instrumental. Uh, say and how things most probably will turn It'll out. It'll be interesting to see things going forward from... Yeah, yeah. Abs absolutely, absolutely. Will you still be feeling like that next year, I wonder? Um, I, I, think, I think the Syrian thing cannot be solved without Russia. What about you, Claudette? <coughs> Highlight for the end? Well, it's definitely the work that I've been doing for the Manukau Urban Māori oh. Authority, but I also want to give a good, work, big shout-out to the kaimahi that are at Māori Television. Oh, yes. And regardless of what Horne says, there is some outstanding work being done by the kaimahi, both in Te Reo and those that are still on their language journey and still upholding the values of um, Kai Whakapumo, but also to the independents that um, make the majority of the programmes that are, that are on Māori Television. Outstanding real strategies around those programming to ensure that the real gets out into every household. So I take my hat, out, hat off to both those kaimahi in Māori television and to the independent companies. Thank you for that. Now, Hune, I, I suppose a lot of people are asking about mana. Calvin said such a great year. Yep. Uh, yes. You'll be concentrating on the community for the next few years now? Well, first of all, my highlights of the year. Yes. Um, <laughs> going to watch my mokopuna perform at the National Primary School Kapahakas. Yes, down in fabulous. Yep. And she was absolutely fabulous. And the event wasn't, wasn't so bad either. Uh, secondly, um, celebrating 42 years with my good darling wife, Hilda, mm -hmm. and looking forward to the next 42. Um, what was the thing you were just talking about? Mother's still alive. Oh, mother. Okay, we got it. We got it. Well done. I want to go to. Yeah, no, no, no. I just I've got a lot of lot of stuff uh, focusing on up home, uh, the rugby league, the breakout, um, trying to help people who the iwi aren't able to or, are, or unable to or unwilling to help, right. and just doing what I can to help Kuda stay alive. Congratulations. I want to go to you, Mitty. You wrap it up for us, but I want to congratulate you on the interview of the year with Derek Fox. Fantastic. Oh, thank you, Willie. It's, just, it's been a really good year, and uh, where are we? This camera, are we? Um, it's been fun, hasn't it? It's yeah. been really nice. It's nice to have you guys all here. Lovely to have you with us during the year, Willie, of course. Um, and we're missing Scotty this morning, but yes. we know he's with us in spirit. Yes. <laughs> uh, and we'll be back next year, of course, too. So to our panel, Tauhenare, Hone Harawera and Claudette Hawiti, thanks for sharing all of your thoughts with us this morning. And from the Marae team, all the best for the new year.